What do super rich people buy when they already have several homes, a garage full of cars, and a miniature giraffe? Whatever dumb thing they can possibly think of. Here's a look at some of the most ridiculous things rich people have purchased. Stewie Griffin Diamond Necklace Nobody ever accused Justin Bieber of making the best choices, so it's no real surprise that back in 2011, when the pop singer was just 17 years old, he spent a small fortune to buy a massive diamond necklace featuring Family Guy character Stewie Griffin. What? The gigantic necklace was made from 14 karat gold with 12 carats of diamonds and rubies encrusted in it. But there was at least one person who thought it was a great purchase. You try to make it in the cartoon pictures, and this happens, and you say to yourself, my god, I'm there. John Lennon's Tooth In 2011, Canadian dentist Michael Zook purchased a discolored, decrepit molar removed from John Lennon's mouth at an auction. He paid $31,200. So I ran upstairs, I told my daughter, I said, I got the tooth. She said, what the f*** did you do? The tooth had been given to Lennon's housekeeper, Dorothy Dot Jarlett, back in the 1960s after a trip to the dentist to get it removed. Zook actually has a reason for buying the tooth, though, beyond being a weird rich person. He hopes to use the DNA to one day clone Lennon. Good luck. Pure Gold Shirt In 2013, a man from India by the name of Datta Puge dropped a quarter of a million dollars on a solid gold shirt that weighed in at six pounds and took a team of 15 goldsmiths two weeks to make. When asked why he commissioned the shirt, which came with matching cufflinks and rings, Puge told the mirror, I know I am not the best looking man in the world, but surely no woman could fail to be dazzled by this shirt. Unfortunately, this story actually has a tragic ending, as Puge was murdered in 2016 after allegations surfaced that he was misappropriating money. Solid gold shirts aren't cheap. Diamond Hermes Birkin Bag With an entry-level price tag around $7,000, even a regular run-of-the-mill Birkin Bag is a status symbol like no other. But in 2017, a private collector spent $379,261 for the ultimate Birkin Bag at a Hong Kong auction. The albino alligator skin bag boasted 245 diamonds, but it's just the latest in a long line of ridiculously expensive bags from Birkin. A similar model set the previous record at just over $300,000 back in 2016. Bridgeville, California You've probably heard of rich people buying their own private islands, but for some reason, they also seem to be in the market for small mountain towns in California. Bridgeville, California, which has a population of about 30 people, has been bought and sold several times in the past two decades. In 2002, it sold on eBay for $1.78 million. But when the buyer backed out of the deal, a guy by the name of Bruce Crawl purchased it for the bargain price of $700,000. Four years later, after fixing things up, Crawl put the town back up for sale. It eventually ended up in the hands of a 25-year-old entertainment manager who bought it for $1.25 million but later committed suicide, putting the future of the town in doubt. Lunch with Warren Buffett Each year, billionaire financial guru Warren Buffett auctions off a lunch with himself in order to raise money for a charity organization in San Francisco called Glide, which offers food, shelter, and other services for those who are homeless or battling substance abuse. And he's raised a lot of money doing it. Because in 2016 alone, the winning bid from an anonymous woman came in at a cool $3.46 million. Fortune magazine later revealed that she and seven of her friends had dinner with Buffett at the famous Smith & Walensky Steakhouse. It's a lot of money for a decent porterhouse, but at least in this instance, the money is going to a very good cause. Thanks for watching. Click the grunge icon to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Plus, check out all this cool stuff we know you'll love too.